Hey guys, welcome back. So in this video, we will see how to traverse in the table and how to access an element into the Selenium code. So this is a table into the sample Selenium page. And uh, if you want to see the source of that, I will do a right click and click on inspect. So it should show me the source. If you see, this is the table and then there's the T body and then there's the TR. Okay. And under TR, there is given TH three times, so that is the table heading three times. And the second TR, you can see the TD, which is a column, which are all the columns which we have. And in third TR, that is mean the third row, it has again the TD. Let's assume I want to access this Jackson name here, and I want to print that through my Selenium code. So for that, I can access that through an XPath. I can access even through a CSS selector, but right now I will try to use the XPath. And if you know, for, get, for a relative XPath, I will start with double slash and then I will type table here. Okay. And under that, I can give T body. And then I want to select a row. So it would be my third row. And to reach to the second column, I will type slash TD and in that two. So this is the XPath which I can use. Let me just copy it. Okay, if you see it is selecting that out. So we are traversing in a table right now. And this is my code. This is the three lines of code, which we always write. So I have already written that. So we are setting up system properties. We are instantiating our object driver. And then we are opening a page to driver.cat. Okay. Now, if I want to print something for this table text, I can write system.out dot print ln just wait for a while so that this R glass can go away okay and under this print ln I can give something like text for the element is okay and then I can write driver dot find element by dot xpath because we are using xpath and here I can give the xpath which I have copied okay so what it will do it will try to find the element through this xpath we have closed this bracket here for the find element and once it is fine what I want I want to get its text okay so I will type dot get text okay and then I will put a semicolon at the end so this will access and table and this will try to print on the table through this X path so this is one of the question which is asked in an interview also that how do you access an element in the table so this is the way how we can do that let's try to run this now So it has opened the page. So once it will wait till the time a page gets open. And once it is open, when it is fully loaded, it is trying to find uh, the name and it has printed Jackson here. If you see in the logs, okay, text for the element is Jackson. So this is the way we can traverse in a table and we can get into any element by using this X path even if we have embedded tables it means if we have a table inside a table and then there is an element inside that we can traverse through this X path and we can get that element all right so that's it for now thank you for watching